Hey friends, this is Ms. Cooster, your favorite art teacher. Um, we're gonna practice drawing a spiral line, which is what Hermit Crab has on his shelf right here. That line right there. Oops. <laughs> it's so hard to do this backwards. Anyway, it's this line right here that goes around and around and around. And we're gonna practice drawing that line because we're gonna draw it onto our paper plate. Okay, but we wanna practice first. Actually, I think maybe we'll put it on this side. Okay, so I have my marker and I have my whiteboard. So if you don't have your marker and whiteboard, go ahead and get that. Let's count to 10 together while you while some of our friends get their whiteboard and their marker. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Okay, so now I'm gonna tilt my camera down so you can see my whiteboard. You probably won't know that you're looking at my whiteboard until I start drawing on it, okay? I'm gonna take my marker and I'm gonna draw a dot in the middle of my whiteboard. So everybody draw a dot in the middle of your whiteboard. Okay. And now you're going to take your dot on a walk. So to put your marker on the dot and start going around and around and around and around and around and around till you run out of room. What do you guys think? Does your line look like my line? This is a special kind of line called a spiral. And it goes around and around and around and around. Let's practice again. I'm going to wipe my board with some tissue or paper towel or a lonely sock. All right, are you ready? Let's do it again. I'm gonna tip my whiteboard, my camera down so you can see my whiteboard. I'm gonna draw a dot in the middle of my whiteboard. And now I'm going to go, start going slowly around and around and around and around and around. Okay. Good job. If you wanted to practice a few more times before you get started on your paper plate, you can. Remember, if you weren't able to get one of these on your own, you can pick one up. There's some bags for kindergarten, some art bags for kindergarten in the office. Just ask the staff in the front office nicely and they will give you one and you will find a paper plate in it. So um, what we're gonna do with our paper plate is we are going to draw that spiral on there. And we want to be able to see it really well. So a marker would be great, but let's use a pencil first because it's important to be able to erase a mistake. And pencils are good for erasing mistakes. So Ms. Kuster has a pencil here. It has lots of cows on it. It's from one of her big favorite vacation places, which is Switzerland. So she's gonna take her special pencil. Now I'm gonna tilt the camera down again so you can see my paper plate. And I am going to do this so you can see it a little bit better. And I'm gonna do the same thing we did before. I'm going to put a dot in the middle and now I'm gonna travel Take that dot on a walk. I'm gonna go around and around. Whoops, falling off the edge here. 
and around. Whoops. And around. I think I'm going to stop there. I was having a little bit of a problem with the edge here. It's a good thing I used a pencil, huh? Okay. And it would also be good if I had a really good eraser. Wait a minute. I think I do. So here we go. There's my spiral, my shell. Okay. Is it perfect? No. Is that okay? Absolutely. So now I'm going to go over it with the marker. Ms. Cooster is really good at this because she's done it a lot. You might want to go a little bit slower with your marker. There you go. Okay. So now we have our shell for hermit crab. Um, when we meet again tomorrow, we are going to um, decorate our shell with some different items that you are looking for around the house. Um, and also, if you, again, wanted to go to the office and pick up a bag of some supplies that you could glue on your hermit crab, you can do that too. Okay? Um, I look forward to seeing you tomorrow. Bye.